What's going on, YouTube gang? It's Mellow DFS coming to you live and direct. Here to give you my fave five plays for today's 10 game main slate. Today is April the 22nd. Hope everybody's having an amazing start of their week. Feel free to like this video. Please subscribe. And if you don't mind, press that bell icon to get notified for future videos. Want to say happy Easter for everybody. Had to take a break for the weekend and starting fresh for the first day of the week. Let's get into it. Go on my pitcher for today. Now going with pitcher, I'm going to go with Mike Miner in a great spot today going against Oakland. Now, might think it's not a good spot, but love this play. Now he has 10 wins in the past 20 starts. All right, he has an average of 3.02 ERA, a 17.9 face face points per game. All right, check him out. Going against Oakland, a 211 batting average against the Athletics. All right, now he's getting about 6 5.6 innings pitch a game of 131 strikeouts. Projected to get around 10.5, but I still love this play. As you can see, check him out against Oakland. He had 24 uh, 14. I feel like he, he could do damage in this play today. All right, so I love this spot. He had 40 last game against the Angels, 18 30 in the past three in the, um, past three games recently. So I'm going to go back to this well in this spot. I will go with Chris Sale, but knowing with the weather, you know, we got to touch base in this weather, but he plays well against Detroit. As you can see, 34 22 29 in the past three games against Detroit. I love that play. And also, another play at pitcher going. Joe Musgrove, y'all, check him out, going against Arizona. Now that line is averaging a 23.8 strike rate, all right, against right-hand pitchers. He's averaging 22 face points per game in three favorable games and also in three home games. Love the spot, He's averaging uh, 24.2 in hard contact. He's been doing well, as, so check him out, past five games, 20-23-33 in the past four games. And, you know, he's not doing well against Arizona. But I feel like with Arizona in this play, he should do well. He has a 233 bad average against them. And he's getting about 5.8 in his pitch in this spot for today. So I love him in this position and, and pitcher for today. All right. Now let's go to our first baseman. Now, first baseman, let's take a look at Ryan Zimmerman. I love him in this spot against Colorado. We got Coors Field. He's averaging 2.5 pace points per plate appearance against left-hand pitchers. He's averaging a 200 batting average against him. Uh, Anderson for today. But he had home, one home run, two RBIs in that play. He's averaging 13 RBIs in the past 20 games. Again, a 60, uh, 600 ISO, a 390 Woba against Anderson. Love this spot. As you can see, Anderson gives up a 798 OPS against right-hand bat. And Zimmerman, Zimmerman does well against left-hand pitchers, a, 550, uh, a 951 OPS. A 31% advantage in this play today at 4,300 on DraftKings. You're looking about 900 less on FanDuel, but love this position for him in this spot for today. Let's go to our second baseman, number three play. All right, you go with another play at Brian Dozier at 4,300. If we don't, let's go out on this list, get some savings. I like. Yo, Mar Sanchez. All right, he's in a great spot against Baltimore. 3,600 is a steal. Projected to get around seven uh, face points. Projected to play at 3.9 at bats a game. Love this spot for him today against Baltimore. As you can see, against Baltimore last five, 23, seven, you know, six. But going against, going against Hess, easy spot. In, um, in three play appearances, he had one home run against him. All right, and has to give up about 2.2 fans points per play appearance against left-hand batters. He's averaging 7.4 fans points per game in 20 high-scoring games. Uh, he has a 3-3-3 bad average against Hess. Like I said, a homer. He has one stolen base, two RBIs, a 1.0 ISO, a 650 Woba. Love the spot at 3 6 uh, 3 1,600 on DraftKings, 1,100 less on FanDuel. So you want to pay less in this second baseman spot. Look at Yomar Sanchez. All right. Now let's go to our third baseman. All right, number four pick for today. Got to go back to this well with Alex Bregman. He's been balling, y'all. So got to plug him in. All right. He's in the great spot again. All right. At home against Minnesota. 
All right, now, you might think with Minute Maid Park, he loves Minute Maid Park. He's averaging 22.7 fantasy points in the past three games at home. All right, averaging 13.6 fantasy points per game in 20 high-scoring games. All right, he's a pitcher-friendly park, but he loves playing at home. Got to plug him in this place. You can see in the last five games, 21-16. Uh, against Minnesota, he had 23, 9, 17, 20 in the past four games recently. All right, going against or is he? He going to ball out? He has 667 um, batting average against him in three play appearances, one single, one home run, a 226 OPS against right hand pitchers. It's a two percent of advantage, but he does well. So 4,800 with these stats, plugging him in as my guy for today. All right, he has a three. 0.8 at bats a game. Love them in this spot, y'all. All right, let's go to my last play at outfielder. All right, last play. All right, let's go to David Dahl, y'all. In a good spot. Love him in this play at cores against Washington. Going against Hellickson. Um, it's a good position for him for today. Now he's at cores again, but averaging 2.2 fantasy points per play appearance against left hand. I mean, right-hand pitchers. Washington bullpen also gives up about 2.2 fantasy points per play appearances against left-hand bats. You can also plug in like a Blackman that could do damage in this spot as well. All right, he's averaging 12.5 fantasy points per game in over 20 favorable games and also in 20 high-scoring games. So you're looking about um, 11 over and under in this play today. So about a 5.5 implied total in this spot. Uh, with Washington and Colorado for today. So I love David Dahl in a great position. And yo, that's my fave five. And also with the sneak pick with Yomar Sanchez. All right, if y'all like my plays, definitely give it a thumbs up. Any questions or concerns with your line, feel free to comment below. As you can see, you can draft dashboard tools in the link in my description. All you do is click the watch players. You have access to my plays. Click that watch Metal DFS picks button up top. You have access for DraftKings and FanDuel. Also for NBA, y'all. It's only one dollar for 30 days, so why not cash? Alright. We have access to your position optimizer, the MLB cheat sheet, the sleepers, your studs, the player trends, and the lineup optimizer to generate quality lineups. I love y'all, man. Y'all collect that bag for today. S Metal DFS. Y'all stay blessed. See you in the next video.